This is Sharon, Sammy, and Naomi, and we're doing chapter 5.3, number 47. And our goal is to use the side lengths in the figure to list the numbered angles in order from smallest to largest, given that the measure of angle 2 is equal to the measure of angle 5. And our first step is to see that the side opposite angle 5 is the smallest side in that triangle and that the measure of angle 2 and the measure of angle 5. We know that the measure of angle 4 and the measure of angle 6 are both greater than the measure of angle 2 and 5. And since the side opposite of angle 6 is bigger than the side opposite of angle 4, we know that angle 6 is larger than angle 4. And since the side opposite angle 2 is longer than the side opposite angle 1, we know that the measure of angle 1 is less than the measure of angle 2 and 5. And since the measure of angle 1 is less than the measure of angle 4, we know that the measure of angle 3 is greater than the measure of angle 6. And so that's our order and our answer is right there, and you've got our answer.